my name is Caitlin with Last Palm Dog, and today I'm here with Shelby, and we're working on some loose leash walking. Now, today we've also got my volunteer, Abby, and her partner, Bo, and they're going to be helping us by acting as a distraction for Shelby. Now, Shelby's doing really good with her training, but she does get really excited when she sees other dogs that she could possibly play with. And so today we're just walking back and forth with the goal that no matter what, Shelby's going to give us a polite walk, as well as Bo. Bo also gets really excited when he sees female dogs, so same thing. We want to make sure no matter what, they can provide us a polite walk. Now, just like always, the rules that we're following are no pulling, no dragging, and no sniffing the ground. And we always start with the dog's name and then the command. So it's going to be Shelby. Let's go. And now you see she's looking away, but I'm already going to start walking. Ah, come on. Good girl. And that's because I want Shelby to understand that we're going to start the walk whether she's looking or not. Come on. Come on. You see, Shelby's definitely distracted. You see her head's going off to the side. Uh-uh. She's pulling a little bit. So you see, I'm just giving corrections as needed. Now, correction is not a pull. I'm not pulling Shelby to where I need her to go. It's just a snap or a pulse. And what that will do is it will communicate to Shelby that whatever she's doing needs to stop. Come on. Come on. So you're giving her a little bit of encouragement because you see she was slowing down a little bit. She wasn't dragging. She wasn't trying to sit at all. But she was a little slower than I would like. Come on. Good girl. You seem much better. And I love that she's giving me eye contact. That right there is really nice. Come on. Good girl, Shelby. Good girl. You see, she's leaving a little extra space between us. But that being said, like I said, she's not drifting off. She's not trying to pull away. Come on. Now, if Shelby was putting a little too much space between us, then I would just give her a correction, especially if she tried to pull away. We don't want to allow any kind of drifting. Come on. All right, we're going to do one more lap, but both dogs are doing really nice. You see Bo is slowing down a little bit, so Abby's just using her voice. Come on just to encourage him, just like Shelby. Both dogs are doing really nice. All right, we're gonna make one last turn right here. Come on. Oh, bless you. All right, and then to stop with our dogs, we're just gonna say their names and then take a couple extra steps. So it's gonna be Shelby. Good girl, and you see, Shelby gave me a very polite sit and Bo stopped perfectly next to Abby. Overall, really nice job from both dogs. You can see both were very polite and even though Shelby was definitely distracted in the beginning, you can see even though she was distracted, she was still giving us a polite walk. Bo did an excellent job. You saw he was glancing at Shelby a little bit, but he didn't try to pull Abby, didn't try to drag. Overall, really nice practice session with both dogs. Let's go. Good job, guys.